This video is being recorded uh, to demonstrate problems playing back content from other PVRs in my whole home network. I've got a Rogers Nextbox 3 whole home PVR. It's an HD PVR. So I'm going to go and hit the list button. There's my screen of recorded content. I'm going to go up and pick something that wouldn't play back. I'm going to go to this episode here. Um, I don't know if you can make it out in the video, but it indicates that it is new, top right hand corner. And I have three options, watch, delete, or manage. Now in another video, I showed you that this episode would not be deleted. So I try to watch it. So here we go. Here's what happens when I try to watch it. Enter. I don't know if you can read that, but it's a white box that says undefined, which is probably the most useless error message ever. Now, I didn't hit anything, but you'll notice that the display on the screen just went black. I'm looking at the HD PVR. It continues to show the time, 4.12 p.m. It shows the whole home PVR icon, the little house, and the power icon. So the box hasn't crashed. The UI has just decided to switch off and leave you with a blank screen. On my remote, I'm pushing exit. Nothing happens. I'm pushing guide. Nothing happens. Oh. And a good surprise, it did give me a guide. Usually that doesn't happen. I'm going to flip to another channel, and it comes in. Let me try that again. I'm going to hit list. I'm going to this time pick another piece of content. I'm going to try to watch this content. And guess what? Undefined. As an aside, this was reported to Rogers back in August, and I believe August the 10th. This is now October 5th. There has been no resolution here. I've gone ahead and deleted over 130 items. I believe the number is 132 items um, that were giving me this error as per Rogers support. Now, it's been a few months, and as you can see, it still isn't working. I was promised a call back by somebody, uh, a technical support person, and this is as per a customer care person who issued a large credit, so thank you for that. But um, as you can see, uh, Three months after the Navigator software was introduced, we're having problems playing content from other PVRs. Now, I've got three boxes in my whole home PVR network, this next box 3, an Xbox 2 HD PVR, and an HD terminal. Other boxes on my internal uh, network, but not on the whole home network, is an 8300 HD PVR. That one is not again on whole home. I've got another Nextbox 2, which I was recently told is not compatible with my whole home network, so that would give me more than two PVRs, and two DTA50 digital adapters. Um, and if you're keeping count, that's seven devices, um, three of which are in the whole home PVR network. Um, I don't know what to tell you, but this is not acceptable um, for whole home PVR to continue not to work. Uh, this service was initialized at this address three months ago, and we're still having issues. I'm going to try a different program just for fun. And as you see there, it started and immediately came back to the navigator screen. The playback is started dot 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 please wait message showed up before and after the content stopped playing. I don't know what that is. I'm going to try this other episode and undefined. I'm looking forward to hearing back from somebody. Um, this is beyond frustrating. It needs to be addressed ASAP. Thank you.